Tiny Jelena and I'm here with another video for you guys. Now as you can see from the title of this video, this video is going to be all about creating websites for your business. Now creating a website is not the easiest thing to do. I know that it took me a lot of time to get to where I am in the web design field, okay? But I did want to create a website to just like for one, calm your nerves and then for two, to also kind of give you guys some tips and tricks when it is time to create your website and kind of give you guys my input when it does come to web developers and all that good stuff. Personally, I'm the type of person that likes to do it all. I can sit in front of a computer for hours trying to figure out something and until I master it, I'm not going to stop looking at it. But I do know there are some people out there that will try to attempt something. It doesn't come out how they want it to come out and then we'll just pay someone else to get the job done for them. If you are that person and you would like me, Amani Jelena, of course, to create a website for you, the link is in my description box. I currently have all web design available for $100, which is very cheap in the web design world. So if you guys are interested in me creating a website for you, a fully loaded five page website, I'll leave all the specs on the screen somewhere and what you get with your purchase. You can go ahead and make that purchase and I will get started right away on your particular project. But moving on. So the first thing that I wanna talk about is web developers. Now there's multiple web developers that you can go through. You can go through Wix, you can go through Shopify, you can go through Big Cartel, you can go through e-commerce, you can go through uh, WordPress, you can go through Square, Square Space and so forth. So it's up to you to kind of figure out which web builder in a sense that you ultimately want to go through. Now the top, the, the two web developers that I'm really just going to be speaking on because they are the ones that I'm the most familiar with is going to be Wix and it's also going to be Big Cartel. Those are, in my opinion, the most simple web builders to work with if you're a beginner friendly web developer. Now, the first one that I'm going to speak on is Big Cartel. Big Cartel is super, super simple. For one, Big Cartel creates the website for you, ultimately. You just, in a sense, add your plugins, I like to call it. You're just going to add your logo, you're going to add your products, your prices, your descriptions, and let Big Cartel take it from there, which is super simple. And I know a lot of people have their cons about Big Cartel and how it doesn't look super professional and things like that, which it is true. Big Cartel, you can't really do too much customization on their particular platform. But if you're in the works of starting a business and you don't have the means to invest $500 or $300 into a web designer and you don't really know how to do much web design, Big Cartel is always there in case you do want to launch your business in a, in a still classy form. So that is a perk when it does come to Big Cartel because they kind of like handle the web design portion of it for you and you just kind of give them what they want as far as your products, prices, pictures, logos, policy page, things like that. So that is cool. Me personally, I did when I opened Allure 96 back in 2017. Yikes! I started with a big cartel account. It wasn't the best, but it was a stepping, like it was a step, a step. And then from there, that's when I kind of elevated myself. So you can do what I did. You can start small and work your way up to as big, ultimately as big as you want to be. But the next web developer that I'm going to talk about is going to be Wix. I personally am a major fan of Wix. I know some people talk their smack about Wix, but Wix has done nothing wrong to me. Wix, run, Wix is the web builder that I run both of my websites on. So if you like the way Allure96 looks or you like the way ImaniJelena.co looks, you can have that same exact format in a sense that I personally have. With Wix, one cool thing that I do like about Wix, everything is super drag and drop. So you can literally create an account on Wix Pick a theme that you want. If you have a hair company or if you have a makeup line or a cosmetic line, they have different themes already put in place. So realistically, all you if, you, if you're not super savvy, all you really have to do is pick a theme that they have that goes with your company, change the color scheme around, put your logo in, put the policies in, remove some of the default images that they have or if all the default images that they have 
and you have a website to go. That is one cool thing that I like about it for the beginner friendly aspect. So what I'm gonna do is, because I don't wanna take up too much of you guys' time, I'm literally just going to walk you through maybe like a two to three minute video of me basically messing around with Wix. But also remember, if you don't want to do this on your own or if you know for a fact that this is not working for you and you've, you've honestly tried to create a website for yourself, just remember, I am doing web design and I do have a $100 sale going on for a fully loaded website. And if you are interested, click the link in the description box. But otherwise, I'm literally going to take you behind the scenes of me tampering with uh, my website, Allure96, to show you guys how easy Wix is to navigate. So check this out. when it did come to web design or really needed that extra you know behind the scene viewpoint when it did come to web design if you if you guys do have any questions for me for me you can leave it in the comments section and I'll get to it as soon as possible or you can shoot me an email at amanijelina at gmail.com otherwise check out my sale on amanijelina.co and yeah that's pretty much it that's all I've got for you today but I love you guys and until next time.